Sierra's not here. How dumb do you think I am? On a scale of one to ten, you'll love it. At least I'm not a zero. I took a trip down to the hospital to check up on Sierra, but her crib was empty. I thought she died or something. I almost gave myself a heart attack. We should be so lucky. And then the nurse told me that she'd been released to you. How'd you manage to pull that one off, huh? It's called a court order. Well, I want to see her. Well, you're going to have to talk to Skylar. His lawyer had the decision reversed. Sierra went home with her father. So then, was Skylar ever arrested? Of course not. The hospital didn't want the publicity. And since no one was willing to come forward, he got off. Well, I mean, it's not possible that he was falsely accused. Well, just because you can't prove something doesn't mean that it's not true. Look, Skyler is a menace. I pray for his daughter. By the way, you and he will be doing rotations with me next week. Looking forward to it. Uh, I'd steer clear of Skyler if I were you. I plan on making his life a living hell. You let that freak take off with our baby? Whose baby? Who do you care? You're not the maternal type. And you are? You eat your young. I love my kids. Get out of my house. You better hope nothing happens to that baby. The baby is asleep in the other room and you guys are out here throwing punches? What the hell has gotten into the two of you? You know what? Never mind. Forget it. I think I can figure it out. You guys are fighting over a girl? Gigi? Never mind the little girl that's in there that just lost her mother and can use all the help that she can get. You are a parent. You ought to know better. And you, you're not helping your case any. So grow up. Both of you. You guys want to be parents? Stop acting like children. I'm trying to sort that out. Well? It's a brilliant plan. Guaranteed to get you out of here. Mm, at last. So you're pleased? I have a feeling you're still holding something back from me, Allison. I've told you the plan. Yes, yes, a Skylar Joplin. An integral part of the plan as the baby's father. Yes, but I sense that he has some deeper significance. I have to check on the baby. Do I have to separate you two? Or can you play nice? You need to leave now. And never come back. Oh, I'll be back. With Gigi. Or can you play nice? After she kicks your butt in court. And then we're going to take her niece home for good. And that will be the last time you ever see me. What in the hell was that about? Our baby, like she has any claim on Sierra. Uh, I think I need a drink. Why would she even want her? It's not like Stacy had any money. And the baby's penniless. There's no insurance, no inheritance. You know, people want babies for all kinds of reasons. I really gotta go. I might want to spend a little time with Shane. Oh, yeah, no, I would love to. I mean, like, you know, Shane is the greatest thing that's ever happened to me. But, you know, aside from Natty and Rex, but, uh, you know, I'll catch up on with him tomorrow. Roxy, are you okay? Oh, yeah, me? I'm fine. I'm totally... Because... <laughs> mm. I owe you one. We were having kind of a serious conversation when Kim walked in. Listen, you got to watch out for that girl. Because she's no good. What's wrong? You know Dr. Evans, right? I know of him. I mean, it's not like exactly like we're buddy-buddy. You know, I'm a lowly resident, and he's a big superstar. Okay, right, but he's he's respected, right? I mean, he wouldn't just go off on Skylar Joplin for no reason. Hard to tell. I mean, kind of did seem a little personal, didn't it? But you knew about these allegations? I heard some rumors. And did it surprise you? Oh, um, good. That's, that's not the point of it. Okay, whether or not Skylar Joplin is a stand-up guy or some thieving drug addict, it's it's not the point. Is he Sierra's father? Oh, you're forgetting I'm a police officer. Okay, just be honest for half a second, okay? You're, you're just trying to rationalize leaving a helpless infant with a man that you just found out might be a little bit shady. Is he? Kyle, is he shady? I don't know. 
But just because I don't like them doesn't mean that the rumors are true. So then, so maybe it's fine. You know what? I'm sure that it's fine. The board would have taken action if there was a problem. So, she's fine. Can't take a child away from a competent parent, Rex. Not gonna happen. Competent parent. And once Gigi and I and Kim get Kim? through with you... Kim? Kim is my witness. You call her, she'll clear me. She watched me dump the oxytocin. That she can prove you stole. Doesn't matter. I didn't use it, Rex. Board dropped the charges. You have nothing. And you're living on borrowed time. Because once a loser, always a loser. And sooner or later, you're gonna slip up. And I'm gonna be there. And I'm gonna do what you did to me. I'm gonna take it all. Your kid, Gigi, I'm even gonna take your career. You're gonna have nothing. And that's a promise. Tell me, Allison, what does Skyla and Joplin have to do with our plan? Well, Miss Balsam, time's up. <laughs> To be continued. Allison. Just remember the plan. And soon you'll know the whole story. Well, I really gotta go. Hold on a minute. We didn't finish what we were talking about. No. I thought we had. You were telling me about Allison taking your baby. Yes, yeah, she did. At the hospital. And nothing happened after that? <laughs> you want me to talk to you about the bill? <laughs> Roxy, I felt like you had something more to say. No, I really didn't. Like you said, Rex turned out fine. So, like, everything is just fine. Her coat 